everybody and welcome back to Minecraft Dungeons and today I am going to be looking at the brand new DLC for Minecraft Dungeons called the Hidden Depth and I'm also going to be looking at the brand new birthday event so it's a uh, Dungeons anniversary today and it's going to be available from May 26th through June 8th and I think you get like a lot of like really cool stuff and I think there was also uh, some other updates uh, to the game as well that add some new features. Because I think there's like a new raid feature that happens. I got a message about it when I joined in. So we'll see if that happens. Uh, but we do have our luxury merchant over here who sells a bunch of cool stuff. I'm not going to be getting anything from him today because we're not doing any ancient hunts. Today what I'm going to be doing is looking at the brand new DLC. Uh, also, we've got uh, the brand new cape, uh, so this is the new event, and you have to complete seven of the seasonal trials, so there's one over here, and it looks like you do get some cool stuff for these. So I'm going to do an episode on completing these uh, later on. Uh, today what I want to do is I want to go over and complete uh, the Coral Rise, which I think is the first level in the brand new DLC here. Uh, so it looks like we've got like a bunch of new stuff. So we've got some new uh, artifacts. We got a new set of armor, a uh, new bow, and it looks like a new melee weapon as well. So let's go ahead and jump into the first level here. And this one I think is like underwater. So it'll be interesting to see how it works. Somewhere far beneath the waves, a shard of the orb of dominance festers. Among the brilliant corals and bubbling vents, corruption seeps from a dark trench and threatens to suffocate all life. It will take a hero indeed to brave the crushing depths and vanquish the terror that lurks beneath. Hey, look at look at my chicken pet. Apparently he's in like a little bubble. Uh, oh, we have oxygen. Wait, does this give us oxygen? Oh, it does. Okay, that's cool. Uh, the one thing is I do want to look at my inventory. Do we have any new pets? Because every time you get a DLC, you do. We got a baby turtle. Perfect. We'll go ahead and clip him. And I don't have the new cape yet because I have to complete the uh, the trials. Uh, let's see. What do I have for weapons? I think I'm going to keep my diamond sword for now. I might switch over... Uh, to something different but I've also got this armor which I think I got this last time during one of my ancient hunts so I'm gonna try that out today I've also got our iron golem uh, so oh okay look at that <laughs> these guys just like float away okay let me try and take one of these guys out look at that wait a minute there's a trident wait I just unlocked a trident so I want to try and use some of the new items so where did that trident just go is that a ranged weapon Wait, where did it go? Oh, wait! The trident's here! Okay, so it apparently takes a spot of, like, arrows. So look at that. So I can, like, throw that. Okay. Apparently, you can use the trident and it just zaps them. What does that do? Shell? Do you do anything? Oh! It does do something. It gave me a free chest and a coral blade. Oh, look at this. I just opened up the map. It shows you where all the uh, the air things are. There's also a blue slime down here. Can I get this guy? Oh, look at the arrows. How they, like, fire, like, slowly through the water. Like, look at that. That That's cool. So if I do, like, a full power shot, yeah, it still doesn't even make it. These guys are just getting zapped by my arrows. Uh, but let me look at this new coral blade. Uh, it's not the, uh, the best weapon, but because it's a new one, I'm going to use it. So here we go. We got our new coral blade. Let's go ahead and head down here and test it out. It does an okay job. I think if it had like a little bit more damage, it probably would be better. Uh, but let's go and grab up these emeralds over here and get rid of the rest of these zombies and keep moving on with the level here. See if I can find any other new stuff. Oh, we've got some baby drowners over here. Oh, right. This is not going well. I need to switch back to my other weapon. Oh, I just got another trident. Let's try this out again. Wait, I want to see it explode. Yeah, there it goes. So it explodes after like a certain amount of time. Oh, and we've got more of these uh, uh, slime. So let me get my regular weapon back real quick. Uh, there we go. We got our diamond sword here. I don't know how burning enemies works underwater, but okay. 
Uh, one of the things that I wanted to test is I wanted to see what happens if I fully run out of oxygen. Do I just like immediately die or does it slowly take damage? That's what we're going to find out here in a second because it's going down fairly quick. Oh, there's another chest over here and my oxygen is almost out. I do have uh, some bubbles here. So if I need to, I can get it back. All right, so it does kind of slowly take damage. Okay, that's good to know. So let's go and grab up some oxygen and grab this chest. I'm getting a lot of coral blades. They're not really the best though. Oh, look at this. We've got like some uh, coral skeletons down here. Let's go ahead and get rid of these guys. I wonder, do their arrows like stop? Wait a minute. What kind of arrow is that? Look at these arrows. They're not normal arrows. Wait, are, they, are those crossbows? I think these guys have crossbows. It's like a bunch of them. Oh, I found one of the fish. It's uh, called the tropical fish apparently. So I think that's kind of like the food. Here's another one. So there we go, we got tropical fish. Okay, so it heals you and it also gives you some oxygen as well, which is pretty cool. So we'll go ahead and grab that. And there's one section over here that I wanna go and explore real quick. Oh, I found a squid over here. Look at this guy. I don't know if he does anything. I think he just kind of like swims around. I can shoot him. Oh, he just like blinded me. Oh, great. Now I can't really attack anything. Okay, there we go, it went off. Uh, but we do have uh, a few places to go. Uh, there's also a pot of emeralds back here. Let's go ahead and grab that. And uh, I can either go over on this side or I can go on this side. I don't think it really matters. They both go to the same spot. And I think I can also like swim over here. Oh, there's actually a door over here. Let's, uh, let's go in here and see what I can find. Oh, I found the new armor. It's turtle armor. Cool. I don't know if that's going to be any better. The armor that I have on right now doesn't seem to be doing a very good job. I probably should put like the protection enchantment on it. That would probably help. But let's look at this turtle armor. So the turtle armor gives us 1,196 health, gives 35% damage reduction, which is really good. It also gives us a 25% healing boost. So that's pretty nice. I don't know how long I'm going to wear this for. It looks pretty cool. See, I matched my uh, my turtle pet over here now. Oh wait, there's a, another turtle. Look at this guy, there's a, a turtle right over here. I, I think one of the skeletons shot him, but we have a, a friendly turtle that I think probably drops like food or something. But we're not gonna attack him, we're gonna let him be. We gotta get rid of all these skeletons though. Oh, I just found a puffer fish. I might actually die from the puffer fish. Oh, great. Um, I, apparently there's puffer fish in this as well, which is pretty cool. Uh, that's cool to know. Uh, I'm getting close to hopefully the end of this place. I've been going through uh, just this one secret area, and I haven't really found anything yet. But I've just been making my way through, and it's super long. I'm hoping that this is close to the end. No, it's still going. And there's actually a second area that I missed that I need to go back to. So I'm gonna have to go back and explore that as well. So I might do that first before I keep going on over here. Cause this looks like it just keeps on going. So I wanna make sure I explore everything. So I'm gonna go back to the other section. Okay, right, so I've made it back over to the other section that I ended up missing. So I'm gonna see if this leads anywhere. There's also some shells here which uh, I don't think leads anywhere helpful. Uh, but over here is another area that I haven't been at. So let's go over here and see if there's maybe a secret level or something cool. Apparently there's people with pink tridents. There's all kinds of colors of tridents. There's like green ones. I've seen uh, golden ones. I've seen pink ones. It's all kinds of colors. But hopefully this area isn't another like super long path. Oh, look at this. There's the secret level, it's right up there. Hey, right, so I did find it. Perfect, so let's go and make my way up here. I think I have to use these shells and like launch my way across all these islands. What is that? There's like a coral gate here. Uh, we'll have to attack something it looks like. Let's go ahead and get rid of all these mobs real quick. And then I can go unlock the secret level. I'm excited to see what it is. So usually for these DLCs, there's three levels in total. Two of them are like the main levels and then one secret level. So I think this might be the secret level for uh, this, uh, 
for this DLC. There might be another one. Uh, but let's go ahead and get rid of these guys real quick. There we go. Uh, this is like an interesting area. There's like a bunch of places where we have to like launch up. Uh, they get some more mobs. I'm kind of heading away from the level. I need to go back the other way. So let's go back this way and see... What is that? What is that? What are you? Oh, great. We got a boss fight. Um, oh, what is that? Okay, I don't know what's going on with the health bar. There's like four different health bars. Oh, wait. There's four different bosses. That's why there's so many. Oh, great. We got to dodge the lightning. This is crazy. Um, quick. We got to take out one of these guys. Apparently, one of them's already gone. That's good. And I still have my tur turtle armor on, which isn't really the best. Wait a minute, the other one came back. I I it's hard to tell which one of these has, like, the lowest health. I, I think the one I'm attacking right now is the third one. I should probably switch back to my regular armor instead of using this turtle armor. Uh, let's make our way back over here. There is actually a chest that apparently has spawned in. And there's only, like, three guys left. So this one's gone. This guy, I think, is the one with, like, really low health. There we go. There's another one gone. There's just one left. Quick, get away from the lightning. There we go. Okay, we've dodged the lightning. I think the iron golem died. But we should be able to take this guy out, like, really quick here with the sword. There we go. Okay, we took that guy out. And now I can get my uh, treasure up here. And am I able to get the uh, secret level yet? Uh, why am I taking damage? Oh, wait, I'm drowning. Oh, great. Okay, I've died again because apparently I didn't get enough oxygen. There we go. Okay, so I need to get over here, I think. Oh, right, I just fell off. I need to somehow get over there, I think, to get to the level. Oh, wait, this door's open. Maybe this is how we get to the level. Yeah, here it is. We've got uh, this shell right here. So let's go ahead and launch over. Wait, where's the level at? I think it's up this way. Uh, let's see. Is it up on top of here? Yeah, there it is. I don't know how to get up there. Can I jump? I need to get over there. All right, so the new plan is, is we're going to stop right here, grab some oxygen, and then continue our way across the shells. Hopefully, that'll give me enough time. The good thing is I do have my potion, so I can always use that to uh, get my health back. Uh, but this, I think, is the final shell that we need to use to get over to the level. Oh, wait, no, there's one more. There we go. And here is the secret level. Let's go to un unlock it here. There we go. We got the brand new secret level, and now I'm drowning. Oh, great. I need the oxygen quick. Oh, yeah, there we go. We got it. Perfect. So now let's move on to the level here, because uh, there's uh, another spot over here that I was at before. That just kept on going. So I decided to come back here. And that was a good idea because this was where the secret level is. So now that's unlocked, which is good. Uh, so let's go over here and see what's uh, on this side. All right, apparently we've got another gate here that we have to get through. Oh, wait, there's also a door. Wait, so can we get through the gate? I think you can. Uh, oh, wait, here's another puffer fish. Let's go and get rid of this guy. And, uh, if I get rid of all the mobs, I wonder if the gate opens. Because there's... Oh, wait, no, there's a, a button. Uh, I think there might be another one on the other side. Apparently, they did not like me pressing their button. Oh, great. They did not like me pressing their button. Oh, great, let's get out of here. The Iron Golem just got launched. Got rid of all those guys. And now, has the door opened? Or is there, uh, is there some more... Uh, mobs that I have to get rid of. Oh, there's one of these guys. Let's go ahead and get rid of you. And now the gates have opened. So let's see what's uh, over here behind these gates. Hopefully some cool treasure. Oh yeah, there is some cool treasure. Look at all this. We got uh, a bunch of chests here. And we got some emeralds as well. Uh, so let's go ahead and get rid of all these guys. Now let's see what we get out of this chest. Another coral blade. Cool. All right, so it looks like we need to find the gate buttons now. So let's uh, go and explore around here and see if we can find some of these buttons. Looking at the map, it looks like there's one up there. Uh, so we're going to go look at that in a second. I need to get rid of all these skeletons over here, though. 
All right, so I just got the other button here. So now the gate should be open. Oh, wait, that, wait, what is down here? Oh, uh, there is nothing. All right, so I, I think we have to go back this way uh, so that we can get to the gate. All right, so here's where the gate's at. This is apparently what I opened up. So let's see what's beyond the gate here. Uh, looks like there's some more, what was that? Is that a trident? I, I think a trident just exploded or something over there. I need oxygen. Like, really quick, let's grab some from over here. There we go. So, we got our oxygen back up. Oh, great, we got a strong current here. There we go, we got past that. Now, is this a boss area? Uh, is this, like, a safe area? I think this is, like, a safe area in here. Uh, it looks like this guy is, uh, trying to spawn in his vines. So, I think this is, like, the final part of the level here. Um, oh, cool. Uh, oh, this is, uh, one of the conduits. So this thing uh, just allows you to kind of have like uh, like your own personal air bubble. So this is kind of cool. Oh, I just dropped it. All right, so apparently it takes up your like bow slot. So you can throw it like that. So this is actually kind of cool. So I can just like run around with this thing. And now I don't have to worry about oxygen anymore. Oh, great. I just found some guardians. I didn't know they had guardians in this. Let's get rid of these guys like real quick. Uh, there we go. We got rid of those guys. Apparently, we got another one of these guys. Quick, get away. And I think, is that all the mobs? Yeah, there we go. I got another uh, turtle armor. All right, so I'm moving on here with the level. It wants me to go over in this direction. So we'll see what's over there. All right, so I think I'm getting really close to the end. It looks like I just found, like, this underwater ship. It's kind of like a sunken ship here. Um... Oh, great. We get, uh, I think we got a battle here. I'm going to go ahead and drop this thing down so that I can kind of use uh, my bow again. Because when you hold this, you can't use your uh, bow. Uh, I just picked it up, really. I need it, like, down there. But it's actually, like, really helpful to kind of just run around the world without having to worry about the oxygen anymore. And if I just stay in here, I don't have to worry about the oxygen either. Wait, I think I missed a door down here. Is there still more to this level? Let's see, what's in this door? Oh, okay. So it looks like we've got the inside of the boat now. I'm gonna keep this with me. Uh, we do have a uh, button over here. What does this do? Um, oh, right. They did not like me pressing the button. There's apparently a puffer fish. Oh, right, the puffer fish just poisoned me. Okay, so I just got rid of all the mobs. Let's see what's up in this section. Oh, there is a chest. We got some emeralds and a nice chest here. Anything else? No, not really. So let's go ahead and head out and see what's outside of the ship. So outside here, we do have another door over here, which is I think the uh, the door that we're supposed to go into to continue the level. This is actually a really long level. So I wonder when it's actually gonna end. All right, so let's go through this door. And now we're in another new part. All right, so it looks like there's a few places to go. There's this way up here, which uh, I think is locked. Yeah, I don't think we can get in there until we open that gate. Oh, I found uh, the button. So this is the button that we apparently need to press. So let's see, what happens now? Uh, looks like we're gonna have to fight some stuff. Oh, great, we gotta fight a, oh, an Elder Guardian. Wait, I just dropped my thing. I need that for oxygen, there we go. Uh, let's go ahead and get rid of the rest of the Guardians here. Uh, we're going to go throw this down over here so that I can hopefully uh, get rid of this guy with some arrows. Let's go and do some damage with the sword here. There we go. That did some good damage. Now, I don't know if he actually does the, um, the mining fatigue. I don't think he does that in this. In normal Minecraft, those guys are annoying because they put mining fatigue on you and then you can't do anything. But I think this right here is the end of the level. Beyond and it looks like we're going into one of the, the underwater trenches. temples. A mysterious monument is shrouded in the darkness of the deepest depths. Oh yeah, we get to open up our chest. So let's see, what am I going to get out of my chest? Hopefully one of the new artifacts. No, I did not get a new artifact. Uh, so let's go back over here to the levels. And uh, head back over here. Uh, so here is the secret level. It looks like there's uh, one more, which this is just a daily mission. Uh, but this is the next level. Look at all the new stuff. There's so much stuff in here. 
yeah so there's a lot of cool new stuff that I try and unlock so that's gonna be next episode I'm gonna go through that level and then we've also got two artifacts and a new ranged weapon as well but I did find the new coral blade and the new turtle armor so hopefully I could unlock some of the other ones uh, next time and then I've also got two new artifacts here in the secret level so I'll also go through that as well all right, so I think that's going to be it for today. I got to explore the brand new DLC, and I played through the Coral Rise level. And I also unlocked the brand new secret level as well. So I'm going to have to play through that at some point and see uh, what that's like. Uh, but I'm going to go and end the episode here, so make sure to leave a like and to subscribe. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time. Goodbye, everybody.